everybody what's up welcome back to the channel we are at tate's comics right now over in south florida we're gonna go check it out let's see what they got see if we can grab something big shop two stories oh wow i don't think i've ever seen a two floor shop this is awesome it's like a comic yeah, shop yeah, slash yeah. like gift shop that whole area in the front so you guys can open the car and bring it right over here there's an then we got, oh, My Hero Academia. Some toys, a little anime section. Bunch of different manga. Oh, some more statues over here. So I think they kind of broke it up with the anime and then the Marvel DC stuff. So probably on the other side. Nice x mens up there. The first Banshee. You got the Marvel Zombies. Moon Girl Devil Dinosaur. The Wall of Keys. Spawn number one. Oh, and the Do You Poo homage variants. What is this? Ghost Rider. $300. Oh, wow. It's a 1 12th scale Ghost Rider. Gargoyles ones. Oh, they're always sick. They have some pretty cool little bus. I don't know. Maybe we'll get a bus, but there's some more keys behind you if you want to check out those. 350 bucks on the uh, Edge of Spider-Verse. I got some Golden Age. That one's cool. Oh, the girl and the sick. daggers. The Tales from the Crypt. Mm -hmm. What do they have on that? $295. Wow, that's actually a pretty, pretty solid decent. price. $295 on the Tales from the Crypt. And they got $350 on that one. $243. And then look at this Sensation Comics over here. They got Sensation Comics $69 for $245. Oh, oh that's cool, wow. right? That's actually really cool. Yeah. The Marvel Tales for $200. Looks like down there they got a John Romita sketch piece for $1,500. Oh, that's sick with the kingpin. kingpin. Big book right here, Detective, First Martian Manhunter. They got uh, 3,000 bucks on that one. That's a great cover on that detective right there, too. With Batwoman. Some I like nice, her outfit on the motorcycle. Nice 10 centers. First appearance of Kathy Kane. And then the Submariner. Oh, look at these little door knockers. That's funny. You got Pennywise in there. Scream. Or section. Yeah. I like how they have it all sectioned off. Oh, what's in there? Just looks like some uh, Predator comics. Oh, so it looks like they might have categorized the comics for yeah, like... Yeah, with the, this like, is the, uh, the alien Dark Horse section. Yeah, so these are all the different Predator comics. Magnus Robot Fighter. Batman vs. Predator. No, I'm not sure exactly what I'm looking for. I would love to grab like maybe a key or... Yeah, I think we're kind of on the hunt books. for maybe a... A low priced key or whatever kind of pops up at us. Oh, this looks old. This right, is. Looks old. Maybe it's just meant to look old. <laughs> this is from Hasbro 2008. Wow, look at that one. $500. Oh, wow. Those are pricey. Bigger figures over here. Yeah. TE01 OP Leader Metal Deformation. I'm trying to find something. Hmm. All right, yeah, let's try to find some comic books. Yeah, where's the comics at? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's got a little sparkly eyes. Oh, it looks like there's another box that's, like, attached to it, too. This thing's are expensive. But I don't see any, um, picture of it. And I don't want to drop it, so I'm going to put it back. Found this cool Poison Ivy statue. I don't know how much it is, though. Doesn't from DC say. Direct. That was cute. From the DC bombshells. Oh, that's cool. From the movie. It's got a bunch of different hands and things. Let's see what the Batman looks like. These are 150. It's like a Michael Keaton inspired yeah. Batman. Seven thousand dollars. It could be yours. Oh, they're selling it. Yeah. It's like everything in here got a price. Oh, wow, look at these things. Seven thousand bucks. Tell me this does not look exactly like the comic cover. <laughs> oh yeah, like those action figure variants. <laughs> oh, that's sick. I didn't know they were this huge. Aren't they small? The comics are a lot smaller. <laughs> no, the toys. I thought the toys were small. Yeah, I, I think this is just a big. different size one. This might be a. These are cool. Usually it tells you the scaling. That'd be cool to like display up on a wall. Action figure variants that go with those cool toys I just showed. Star Wars has like a million different titles. <laughs> but so does everything else, right? Got some Star Wars droids. Star Wars Empire. I haven't seen any Darth Vader yet. Han Solo. Cool drawers they got over here. Yeah, the drawers are kind of cool. I feel like it's gonna like fall forward, but I'm sure they probably like nailed it into the ground or something. My mom used to buy plates like that because they have to be little birds, not Star Trek. Oh, these are like the nice Marvel and DC ones. I've never seen these before though. Is that what they look like? It looks very realistic. I'm looking for that one. There's that one Daredevil Libra Mayo cover. 
with Spider-Man where they're like jumping across the rooftop. It's an expensive one. 500 variant. Ooh, that's, oh, that's actually cool. sick. That's I think that's Alex Ross. Another Art Adams variant. Oh, this is like a whole little Art Adams section. Oh yeah. So oh, look at that. <laughs> covers, you got Vampirella. You have some Vampirella down there? Down here. This looks like uh, Adam Hughes cover art. Oh yeah, it does. Did Adam Hughes do that one? Oh, that's cool. The Alex Ross on Uncanny 29. That is cool. And then you have the uh, one in, so that's the one in 75. That's the one in 300. Oh, the X Women one shot. That's, oh, that's cool. Yeah, Chris Claremont. Hip hop variants in here. We got some duplicates, but the Mockingbird, Nighthawk, Nova, Royals. I haven't seen a lot of these. Mike Mignola, Batman, Hellboy, and Starman for oh, 20 yeah. bucks. Cool. One through five for forty dollars. What's the condition? They're not oh. perfect, but it's forty bucks. It's a I nice little set. Yeah. What is this? Is this like a? This is huge. Feel how heavy that is. I think it's like twenty oh, pounds. <laughs> Get a workout reading that. Oh wow, because it has. It has all these in it. That's pretty cool. Huge old books. How much is that? One hundred and twenty-five bucks. And you got the John Byrne cover on the front. Do you think they have any spawn? Yeah, I would think they do. I think they have some spawn. Maybe I'll get a trade. I'm on a reading kick. I heard this one's good, Sweet Paprika. That's like the one comic that we had. I heard that one's good. Oh, this is supposed to be good, isn't it? The witches one? Isn't that like optioned or something? Oh, well, those are so cute. Oh, these are cool. Here they are out of the boxes. They're only 54 bucks a piece. Kind of pricey, but... Scotty Young stuff is popular. Oh, I love These are one. great. Look at that little Renew Your Vows one. Spider-Man putting the ring on Mary Jane. That's cute. I've never seen that one before. How much is that? It's only 25 bucks. Oh, here's a whole uh, box of Scotty Young in here. Can never go wrong with picking up a cool Scotty, right? How much are those? $10. $20 for the Thanos. Gotham City Sirens? Oh, that's the second print. Oh, I already got one. On the Gotham City Sirens. Oh, this Sirens. one's the one I like too. That one's cool. You don't Number have a second three print cover. Though. No, I don't have a second print. I think mine's the Whoa, first print, isn't it? what is that? I've never seen that before. It's a one in oh, 10 cool. variant cover on Ghost Rider 22. The first appearance on these are sick covers. Clayton Crane cover right there for 30 bucks with COA. Limited mm. to 1500 on that one. Oh, whoa, look at that. The Ultimate Avengers foil. Oh, that's, cool. that's the one in 25 foil on Blade. That's pretty sick. You got the Fantastic Four. One in 1,000 sketch. What? That's crazy. That's the, is a that George Perez? One in 1,000 sketch? Yeah, it's the George Perez, one yeah. in 1,000. Oh, that's crazy. Werewolf by Night from Marvel Spotlight two through four. And then you have Werewolf by Night one through eight. Like these oh, are really cool. cool. Yeah, if you don't want to buy all the yeah. books. 85 bucks. You get some foils. Um, X-Men Ultra. $50 for 150 cards. That's cool. Yeah. What are these? Oh, these are the Jusco cards. Joe Jusco covers. Oh, that's sick. Remember the variant cover we had? Oh, yeah, that looked like that. It was yeah. the first appearance on the uh, variant. And they got the yeah, I like how they have them in little sets. Like yeah, everything. together is cool. Oh, whoa, look at that. The oh. Daredevil Marvel Secret Wars. Let's see if we can get a good look at him. His secret shield. That's pretty sick. I've never seen that before. I used to love these when I was a kid. Putting these together. Yeah, these things are sick. Okay, for the one reprint. Ooh. Nice. I wonder if they have like a magazine section. Yeah, you would think. Sarah is nowhere to be found. She disappeared on me. But look what I found. <laughs> I'm gonna go try to find her. They got Vampirella magazines up here, originals, and it looks like those are like $25 price tags. She doesn't have a couple of these. I think she has that one right there with Dracula, but I don't know if she has that 13 right there. And then they got Legion of oh, Monsters yeah. mag. Oh, aha, okay. I was just trying to find you. I was just about to say, look what I found. Oh. Those are some nice Vampirella mags up there, and I think they're only 25 bucks. Oh, covers. I know. That one's the earliest one. Is that Dracula on the cover? Yeah, that's a clean copy. How much is that one? Twenty-five bucks? Yeah. Yeah, see this one's nice yeah, though. Look at the one. look at the spine on that. It's one of the later issues, it's issue eighty one. Still need it though. Okay, so maybe that one. I 
Yeah, this one's cool. Mm -hmm. That one looks yeah. pretty nice. That one is a nice one, 11. Oh, that's a sick one. Oh, yeah, that is clean nice. that is, too. Get all three of them. So what is that, the Eerie? So Eerie 35, Vampirella 13, and then 81. All right, well, now I'm good. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> I got my three. So I got two additions to my Vampirella run. Slowly filling that in. But you gotta grab them because it's so hard to find Vampirella mags. Could I take a look at this in here? The uh, Amazing Spider-Man Renew Your Vows. I got you. Are you, a, cool. are you a fan of the artist or more so the... the oh yeah, we're big Scotty Young fans. Yeah, it's a cute cover. That is cute. Sarah always goes for the prints every time we're at a convention or anything. I love prints. I, need, I got too much wall space. I need to fill up my walls. We gotta get more original art though. Well, who's a millionaire? Not me. Not everyone has a lot of money. I know, that's why I wish we would have bought more of Greg Land's original art at Megacon. He was yeah, selling those was pages sick, for like a yeah. hundred bucks. Wonderful. That Spider-Woman I think is still my favorite. Yeah, that's beautiful. You. I love it. And and that's it. All right, good to go. I hope y'all enjoyed our little pit stop over at Tate's Comics. Make sure you check them out, and we'll see you in the next video.